Hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Productions. Now, I've got a film review, kind of a film review. Uh, it's called Troll Hunter. It's borderline Blair Witch, borderline Cloverfield, uh, that sort of situation. Uh, but it's about a young group of filmmakers who want to go to Norway, well, they are Norwegian, and uh, they want to discover whether trolls are myth or real, really. And uh, they stumble across a actual troll keeper, almost. He's an actual troll hunter. Uh, he, he does the job of keeping the trolls in line and away from the public viewing. And uh, yeah, to begin with, the troll hunter, the man himself, he wasn't pleased about the documentary or the round footage, a fockumentary, I think they call it, a fomentary, something along there. But the idea is that the guy who hunts all the trolls, keeps them in line, and kills them if necessary, it's him who eventually comes to the crew and says, right, you know, you can, you can film me, sort of thing. Uh, I will show you the way of the troll hunter. Because he is annoyed at the benefits of pay, really, uh, that he gets from the government. Because he's a government man, he works for the government to keep the trolls in line. It's a Norwegian film, so you've got to uh, read the subtitles. It's not in English. Uh, it's, it's in Norway, so it's a cold sort of based out place. But it's really interesting. Uh, it's Like I say, it's on the border with Blair Witch, Cloverfield, due to the shaky cam. And uh, yeah, this guy, he goes hunting for trolls and there's certain parts in the documentary where you find out if the trolls are light sensitive because it's all at night, you see. So if a troll is actually allergic to sunlight. So he blasts it with UV light. And uh, yeah, you find out if, uh, if trolls do actually feel the pain of being killed and things like that. And it uh, it goes on throughout the film, finding different trolls and different ways of how they are kept in line, how they are killed, and such like that. Uh, there is, I just found this inside the DVD, pretty interesting I found. Uh, troll Survival Guide. Number one, carry a torch. It says trolls in the two is notoriously turned to stone or explode when a daylight exposed to intensive light. Protective headgear, eyewear and a change of clothes are also recommended. So always carry a torch with the troll. Stink like a troll. Uh, combat the troll's advanced senses of smell by disguising your scent with revolting pugnant troll stink harvested from dead trolls. So cover yourself in shit really and smell like a troll. And a uh, famous line in the film, troll. Just wrong. Also gives you a rundown of uh, sizes and also uh, names of the different trolls. Uh, you've got things like Dorve, Dorve Gubra, which is Mountain Kings. Tosser Lad, the three-headed troll. Ringlef Inch, the ferocious. And Lardy Junty, which means John Tar, something like that. But yeah, there you go, usual suspects line up. And in the bottom corner of the man. Uh, but really, it's it's a fun film about trolls, if they actually exist or not. And uh, I found out that apparently the power lines that we think are power lines aren't actually power lines. They're actually a electric fence to keep trolls in. And as soon as I heard that line, I thought, oh, that's kind of interesting. <laughs> Um, but yeah, if if you like your sort of Blair Witch shaky cam, your Cloverfield shaky cam, uh, you don't mind reading subtitles, uh, and you want to discover the myth of trolls and sort of the background about the trolls, yeah, it, it's a fun film. It was made a few years ago. The graphics were alright, actually, uh, because it's all set at night, so the graphics aren't... You can't really question them because it's not daylight, so you can't really see them as bad as what they would be if it was set in daylight. Um, if you've ever seen the trailer of Troll Hunter and you kind of like it then definitely worth getting. Uh, I picked mine up when it first came out for I think it was about a tenner really but I'm sure you can get it for a couple of quid now. Uh, but yeah Troll Hunter it's an enjoyable made up mockumentary uh, sort of film. 
with Shaker Cam uh, about a documentary of uh, a guy who's fed up of all the benefits that he's not reaping from the government of keeping trolls in line and away from humans. Uh, but it's a funny, enjoyable, uh, made up mockumentary of a document troll hunting expert. Um, I enjoyed it. If you don't mind Norwegian subtitles and shaky cam, then this is definitely a film for you. Also, guys, Toby WTD, don't forget, use that promo code for any Weeder Devoted items. Links in the description below. But really, thank you very much for watching my review of Troll Hunter.